by connected component you already know the concept of articulation point and connected component what is mean by by connected component simply a maximal by connected subgraph a maximal by connected subgraph is called a by connected component so difficult to understand okay simple definition is i given a graph to you within the graph if there is no articulation point a graph does not consist of any articulation point then such graph is called a by connected component you know what is an articulation point removal of the any vertex disconnect the graph into multiple subgraphs that is called an articulation point now remember by connected graph does not consist of any articulation point for example assume i given a graph to you convert the given graph into by connected component what is the procedure simple procedure is first identify the articulation point and divide the graph into multiple subgraphs divide the graph into multiple subgraphs and that articulation point is included in the both the subgraphs articulation point is included in both the subgraphs suppose consider one example take any example the procedure is common you can take any example the procedure is common 2 3 4 if you want to extend you can extend suppose 5 this is a graph this is a graph suppose 7 8 7 8 so 6 is missing 6 5 6 7 9 8 okay this is my graph now find out the articulation point simple thing you know that one one is an articulation point yes or no by removing the one zero is one component this remaining thing is another component now i will write down the by connected component simply zero one as a separate component zero one as a separate component now this one is the articulation point this one is common to this one one is common to this one also so 1 2 3 4 now you got it from this part i divide into two components one is 0 1 second one is this one now this is here 3 is an articulation point yes or no 5 is an articulation point then what you are doing 3 to 5 simple thing 3 to 5 3 is included here and this is also one component 5 6 7 understand the point understand clearly here 3 is one articulation point 3 is included here Three is included at this position also. So three to three to this entire graph. In this entire graph, again five is an articulation point. So three to five is one component. Five to seven, seven to six is another component. Suppose remove vertex seven. This is one component. This is another component. So obviously. 8 to 7 is also possible obviously 8 to 7 is also possible and remove 7 9 is another one 7 to 9 now you understand simple procedure find out all the articulation points for this my example one is an articulation point you know that one three is an articulation five is an articulation seven is articulation removal of 6 no problem removal of 9 no problem removal of 8 no problem removal of 3 yes 
This is one component. This is one component. So what are the articulation points? One, three, five, seven. Now consider the bi-connected components by making zero one. This is one part. This is second part. This is third part. And this is one part. This is one part. Why? By removing seven, eight is one component. Nine is one component. This five comma six is another component. That means seven is connected to this one. Seven is connected to eight. Seven is connected to nine. These are the bi-connected components. You understand? A graph which does not consist of any articulation point. This is the way to find out the bi-connected components. Thank you very much.